What's up, it's your boy JC Automation back with another video. You guys really enjoyed this style of videos last time, so I said we're gonna keep it going. Yes, we still need to update this. That is coming soon. Um, but in the meantime, can I take it down? Absolutely, we could. But uh, I got a couple of gray hairs coming in that I'm not super excited about. So until we get the soft sheen cars and rolling, uh, we're going to leave it up there. All right. But uh, that will be updated to fit what the channel is now. As always, if you guys want to tune into my daily stream, there'll be resources down in the description for that. What I want to do in this video is talk to those of you out there about four businesses you can start either as a business or a side hustle. Was completely up to you, and I am going to react to another great YouTuber. Listen, if this is the first video you ever watched of mine, especially if it's the first reaction, the reason why I do these reactions is because I know from firsthand experience that digital mentors work, virtual mentors work. You might be in an environment right now where nobody around you is there that you could talk business with. Well, guess what? That's okay. I was there before too, and watching people online definitely helped me get to the level that I am at now. Now, that does not mean that you shouldn't invest in yourself and buy books, courses, coaching, mentorship. I spend all of that right now, and that has taken me light years ahead of where I would have been if I only stuck with the free content. However, the free content is better than no content to get your mind right, and hopefully this sort of uh, information helps you get to that next level, right? So that being said, again, Follow this content creator, right? That's why I do these reactions. Go subscribe to their channel. The link is down in the description below after watching this video and tell them that JT sent you because now you can add to your digital wheelhouse a series of mentors that you never even met before. You never paid any money, but you watched their content. You got value out of it, all right? And now you're a part of the network to a certain degree, right? Uh, hey, you got to start where you got to start. I started there, so it's not a knock. But without further ado, let's get into today's reaction. The best way to achieve financial stability is to have multiple streams of income. Now, Thanks. if you want to know the most profitable side hustles that you can start today without any money, grab a seat. The side hustles I will highlight in this video can be done by anyone regardless of age, education level, or social status. It doesn't matter whether you are a student, you are an employed person looking Shop for a side hustle, or you are a stay-at-home mom. This can be done by anyone. If you don't already possess the skills I will talk about in this video, you can learn online for free in That's less than a month. In fact, some of these skills you can learn in a matter of days. Now, as we get started, remember to hit the like button for me so that this video can spread to as many people as possible. The Let's first go. side hustle is to become a virtual assistant. This is arguably the fastest and easiest side hustle to start. The number hey, listen. Virtual assistants have made my life way easier. So shout out to my virtual assistants that work with me. Now, secondly, yes, you can do this business. I want to predicate this, and I know somebody's going to say, hey, you're doing a lot of stopping, but I'm stopping to really let you know the little nuggets I got that can really help you maximize this content. As a virtual assistant, you need to start off with a specialization and you need to target people that have the money to pay you a fair price. All right. Now, if you're in the United States, that may mean that for the vast majority of you all, you should not try to become a virtual assistant to men and women that make less than somewhere in the mid six figures. Otherwise, you're going to have a whole lot of clients paying you a little bit of money. And that's how it adds up for you having a different uh, decent, excuse me, decent life for yourself. Now, I personally use um, virtual assistants from the Philippines because they're highly skilled and super cost effective. However, there are some pros and cons that come with that. So if you're in the States, right, which most of you are that watch this, according to my analytics, understand that you can 100% do this. I have a virtual assistant that's an editor for me, and I also am in the process of hiring more. Like, So my personal assistant is going to also be a virtual assistant as well. And as I grow and expand my business, I will continuously hire virtual assistants uh, to help supplement the needs of my business. And there's people that make millions of dollars a year that use 
primarily or solely virtual assistants. So long story short, you can do this. Of course, I got one that does nothing but edit YouTube videos. The one that's my personal assistant is basically an extension of me. So they do a whole lot of projects. That's why I said early on, I recommend that you start with a specialization. Don't be that um, personal assistant or virtual assistant that could do everything for everybody in the beginning uh, because you're going to make mistakes and you will get let go. If you're working for a high level person, they'll let you go before they let the business go down because you're not experienced. So start off with one thing. What are you going to be great at? Email marketing, paid ads, copywriting, editing, whatever that thing is. Uh, and there's not one thing that is the best, in my opinion. It depends on who you're working for. So, of course, if you're going to reach out to a content creator, they need editors, right? They need people to follow up with their emails and stuff. I got like over 40,000 emails, which is not bragging, right? We got to get it under control. Um, and I'm missing out on mad opportunities because I don't have the time to go through all of my emails, right? Um, so that being said, that's a play, off real. Let's keep it going. The number of entrepreneurs and solopreneurs is increasing daily, so there's a rising demand for virtual assistants. Now, if you don't know who a virtual assistant is, this is a self-employed individual providing services like email management, bookkeeping, customer support, and data entry to individuals, companies, brands, etc, etc. Virtual assistants work remotely, which means they do all the work from the comfort of their homes or any other location they choose to work from. There's honestly so much you can offer as a virtual assistant. It all depends on your capabilities and the client's needs. My assistant used to schedule meetings, organize files, do email follow-ups, data entry, update spreadsheets, and all that stuff. The idea is to help with the day-to-day -day management of the business. The amount of money virtual assistants earn depend on the client, the client's location, and the services offered. According to my research, virtual assistants in Kenya earn between 250 Kenyan shillings and 2,000 Kenyan shillings per hour, and this can... Okay, hold on. Like we need to we need to do some math. I have no idea what that is in US dollars. Um shout out to anybody that's international watching this though. So let's say what? Two fifty KSH to USDs. I definitely how I spell that wrong. I'ma blame the phone. That's a dollar and ninety five cent as of right now. All right, you could do it, and the currency may be different, but right now that's saying between in United States dollars now, uh, two fifty is a dollar and ninety five cent. All right, so that's that's not bad at all. And then two thousand ain't gonna be, still ain't gonna be bad. Two thousand would be, oh. Oh, no, no, no. I put too many zeros in that. Hold on. I'm tripping. I'm tripping. Y'all bear with me. I put 20,000. Y'all ain't want to know what that one was. 1557. So they make between $2 and $16 an hour. All right. Which is, which is not bad. Which is not bad. Depending on your business. Can, can we, you know what I mean? Even though this video is designed to be a pretty simple video. Um, for entry level people, can can we also just highlight that you can hire these people and use them to scale your business? No lie, I got virtual assistants that know how to do things I don't know how to do. Now I know what needs to be done, but as far as the technical aspect of it, nah, that's why I'm paying you, right? So I interview them. Do you know how to do this? Yes. Okay, you hired. Do this. So it might be a point in your business where you like, hey, if I could do this, I can go to the next level. But you just don't know how to do that, so you can definitely hire them for that. But I don't want to make this too deep. Um, but, yeah, between $2 and $16, I'm going to round up as of this recording, um, is what they're making. If you're in the United States, if you're in another country, you can, you know, use Google or whatever search engine you prefer to get your conversions. But um, that ain't bad at all.
can be even more. Now, other virtual assistants are paid per month instead of per hour and the estimated monthly income is 10,000 Kenyan shillings and above. Virtual assistants in the US earn $20 per hour on average. So different clients offer different pay rates. Either Yo, now, that's what I'm telling you. At the $20 an hour mark, just specialize in something. Or if you want to go higher than that, just specialize in something. Um, unless you already know you cold at like a whole lot of different things. And you don't got to take my word for it. But I'm trying to set you up in a situation where you can consistently make money and build you a clientele of people. And then maybe you as the primary virtual assistant can create a virtual assistant business where you hire people in other countries and pay them a fraction of what you make and outsource all the work to them. All right, so you could have a specialization like that. I don't know if you guys can tell, but really, like, there's so many plays you could do with this virtual assistant stuff. But let, let's keep it going. Away. This is a lucrative side hustle because Thanks. it's possible to make six figures a month if your strategy is right. You can find virtual That's assistant 17. jobs for beginners on platforms like People Per Hour, Indeed, LinkedIn, and virtual assistant jobs. The most successful virtual assistants also reach out to different brands and individuals who might need their services with offers they can't refuse. Now, virtual assistants is of a offer you can't refuse for anybody that may not know what that that means is i'm going to do this for free and if this is profitable to you and you want me to do more of this then we'll talk about getting paid right so just for clarity an offer that you can't refuse is i'm going to go work for free without you even asking me or telling me what to do I'm just going to do this thing for you and then give it to you and then you use it. And if you make money off of it and want to continue using my services, then we'll talk about salary. Right now, that model doesn't work for everybody. Not everybody is willing to lead with value. And if you're new, you're gambling on the fact that what if you take the time to do some work and it's not profitable? All right. Or it's not as valuable as you think it is so they make a couple dollars off of it and then they they never do it again right so it's like um keep that in the back of your mind just so you don't think it's nothing weird obviously not for everybody so let's look at other profitable side hustles for both beginners and experts the second side hustle is to become an online english teacher did you know Hey, you guys on your own with this. You know, I got South Carolina education. I mess up words all the time. So there's nothing I can do to help you with this one. That over 72% of the world's population does not speak English, even though Didn't it's the that. most popular language in the world. Oh, oh, and it's also the dominant business language. Now imagine how many people in the world would like... English is the dominant business language? Did not know that. That's a nugget to learn the language for business, education, or personal use. I actually read somewhere that over 1 billion people are currently learning how to speak English. So you see, this is a huge opportunity for the people who can speak and write English fluently. You can teach people how to speak the language online and make some money doing it. Now, now has anybody, put it in the comment section, has anybody ever tried this side hustle before? Put it down in the comment section. And uh, if you feel like you're somebody that is fluent in English and wouldn't mind trying this, put it in the comment section before as well. I'm not going to say I never looked into it. i never done it. But I heard about this years ago. I looked into it. And you had to be, like, punctual. You had to pronounce words the right way. You couldn't use any slang. Is To me, it was difficult because, you know, how I naturally talk. And the way that they want you to teach people, right? You you got to talk proper, as they say. And you got to pronounce stuff a certain way, enunciate a certain way. Um, so, yeah, like, and, and that's different companies have it different ways. Now, maybe you find a company that get them speaking good enough where people that speak English can understand them and you in there, right? So, cool, if you can find that, all right? But um, the, the companies that are most popular in this niche usually wants you to, you know, basically be a for real English teacher, not going to play with you. Generally speaking, online English teachers earn between $10 and $40 per hour, depending on the qualification level and the company or individual you are working with. Yep. The company I was talking about was offering $15 an hour starting off, just for reference. So 
Uh, if you do find one that's not as strict, you're probably going to be closer to that $10 or less mark. This is equivalent to 1,198.70 Kenyan shillings and 4,784.80 Kenyan shillings per hour. Research shows that some online English tutors make well over $550 per week. If this is something you are willing to try, check out the following platforms where you can sign up as an English language tutor and start getting your dollars. There is Cambly which pays tutors $10.20 per hour. There is Tutoro, Tutor, T-U-T-O-R-O-O. $8,000 a month. Shoot, I might need to brush up on my English. Where most popular tutors earn up to $8,000 per month and there's Vabling. You can still check out these platforms even if you are fluent in a language other than English because some of them... I ain't never heard of none of them offer multiple languages and by the way these are not the only sites where you can teach english and other languages there are so many of them but you'll need to research to find them now before i talk about the next side hustle i would like to know how are you finding this video so far is it helpful let me know by hitting the like button down below and i will really appreciate it i let's know do from it. let's do it smash that like button if you haven't done so already subscribe to my youtube channel if you haven't done so already go subscribe to their youtube channel after watching this video i'm going to intentionally be repetitive now stay here and get all of this game first but after you get this game go subscribe to them go check out more content let's go personal experience that starting an online business can be extremely scary you're probably about to click off this video because you don't think it's possible for you to have a successful online business well mm -hmm. don't do that yet because i'm about to blow your mind Complete beginners can actually learn how to start a successful online business on Skillshare. Skillshare is a great resource for freelancers and entrepreneurs to help you learn new skills to support your growing side hustle or launch into a totally new career. I recommend starting with this class by Tracy Wallace called E-Commerce Essentials how to start a successful online business. I also love this class by James Hutchinson called Start Your Online Business from Scratch. There's so much to learn from these classes. In the first class I mentioned, you'll not only learn how to start your business, but also how to make your business profitable. In the second class, James will teach you how to start and you'll also learn how to market your business and manage your finances. Now, Skillshare has allowed me to offer the first 1,000 people to join Skillshare using my link, a one one month free trial so you have the chance to take the classes i have mentioned and further explore the skillshare class level shout out to skillshare and i'm not a hater so definitely that link will not be in my description go to her channel and click that link and you know show her some love library completely free for one month the link is in the description box below and thank you so much skillshare for sponsoring this video the third side hustle to consider is becoming a skills trainer which skill you'll teach really depends on the skills you possess. Are you a good cook or chef? Do you know how many people want to learn how to cook specific meals? Are you a dancer? Can you teach people how to dance? Are you by any chance a fitness enthusiast? Personal training is becoming the in thing. Can you fight? Then teach people self-defense. Do you consider yourself a TikTok expert? Can you teach people how to create TikToks? How to use TikTok filters, hashtags, etc. Like the list of skills you can teach people is endless. Some of these skills are delivered in person while others are done online. Either way, this is something you should consider doing. And remember, no skill is useless how you package yourself is what matters in fact before uh shameless plug here i can teach any brand how to get over a hundred thousand uh followers but what does that quantify into dollars if anybody out there is a blue collar business owner making between five to ten thousand dollars a month but they're not making that much off of the social media or website related to their business i can easily help them double their income right their annual income it'll be like a 12-week program if you guys want to take advantage of it let me know um to be honest it's a four-figure investment so it's not for everybody but that reminded me and usually i don't even you know mention it in these sorts of videos because i know the vast majority of people are not interested in that but hey it's out there right you guys let me know if you're interested in that um 
keep going. Before I started recording this video, I was calling different gyms and individuals I found online because I am looking for a personal fitness coach. So you see, this is something that other people are already doing. The amount of money you'll earn from this will depend on the specific skill you are offering, your location, and your target market. Most of the fitness trainers I called today charge around $20 per session and I'm sure this varies from trainer to trainer. Now, if you choose this type of side hustle, you need to market yourself very well. Design professional promotional stuff on Canva for free like posters and share consistently on Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, YouTube, community tab, and link. She giving organic gems, like growing organic, selling organically. It's a consistency game for sure, but don't sleep on that, right? Canva is a play. Most content creators that know about Canva use that to make their thumbnails. Of course, it's some over-the-top ones that use other ones, but a lot of them, myself included, Canva. LinkedIn. You can even record short videos like Reels and TikToks to just give people a visual clue of what to expect. In addition to that, you can list your business on Google with a free business profile formerly known as Google My Business. For Google My Business, all you have to do is provide details of your business, contact, photos, videos, etc. so that customers can easily find you when searching for something related to what you offer. Remember to also create a LinkedIn site service page to showcase your business or service. The fourth side hustle is writing CVs and resumes. Let me tell you, a lot of people suck at writing resumes and CVs. Some people miss out on opportunities simply because they can't or don't want to write resumes and cover letters that meet the job specifications. Now, this is where you swoop in, save the day, and make some money in the process. And yes, this is an in-demand service. You have no idea how many people reach out to me on a daily, asking for help in crafting their transcription resumes. So if you are good with words and can highlight people's best qualities in writing, you are in luck. Truth is, writing a good resume is not as difficult as people assume. It Especially nowadays, with artificial intelligence, shout out to Chat GPT and others that are going to come down the pipeline may already exist depending on when you watch this video. I'm also going to end the video right here. If you guys got value out of this video, you already know what to do. I've been saying it the whole time. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Smash that like button. Share this video with 10 people that you know it will help. The reason why you're sharing it with 10 people is not because it's going to help me, but because it's going to help you, right? Now, am I going to get a benefit from it? Hopefully, you know what I mean? But bigger than that, it's going to take a team, all right? It's going to take a team. So you don't want to be the only person in your circle that's winning. And now family members blowing you up, friends blowing you up, people from back in the day now feel like you owe them because they bought you a bottle of, of soda back when y'all was in high school a long, long time ago. So you sharing this video um, with your team so that way you can get like-minded people so when it's time to pull y'all money together or pull whatever other resources y'all got together to make that bag, they already thinking how you thinking. It ain't no convincing. They already know what time it is because you already helped them get on the same type of time as you. All right, hope that makes sense. And hey, as always, you guys keep sending me these videos, right? I'm really feeling them. I'm, I'm in grind mode, if you guys cannot tell. All right, if you guys cannot tell, I'm in grind mode again. We back doing reactions. Um, we, we gonna keep using this lens, cause I told you guys, right? I spent what I thought to be a lot of money for, for a lens, right? Um, hey. And just like that, talk, talk, hustlers, stay hustling. JT Automations, somebody's at the door, so I'm gone.